I'm going to explain about how to make connections of any circuit on breadboard. First of all, we need to know how breadboard will be. If you look at here this picture, the breadboard is consisting of four parts. Wait, one, two, three, four. One and four will be in similar, and two and three will be in similar. Okay. The first part is consisting of two horizontal rows. The first horizontal row is divided into two parts, and second horizontal row and same. Second and third consisting of only vertical strips. If you open breadboard, the breadboard will be look like this. The first half is divided into two horizontal parts, and second and third. be in will be have only vertical strips it implies it shows that second and third this vertical strips or lines shows that it has different potentials this this line consisting of a different potential different potential different every line can have a different potential here also you can find different potential in this line in this line okay you can find different potential here and here yes and uh, this is about the breadboard when if you want to construct any circuit on breadboard first of all we need to find different potential nodes in a circuit what are different potential nodes in a circuit okay see this circuit already i have made a different potential nodes what is mean by different potential node okay see that the point 1 okay one of the one of the end of battery and other end of resistor it's a different potential node one of one end of resistor and other end of ammeter and if you see this one end of ammeter one end of ammeter and other end of diode and one end of ammeter other end of voltmeter other end of resistor if you see this fifth point fifth point it's looking like a four different points but every point it connected to a single point single potential node single potential node you can find a different potential at 2 at 1 at 2 at 3 at 4 and and the fifth point every point is connected to a single potential yeah we made and we found five different potentials five different potentials Five different potentials. Okay, five different potentials. Okay, if you want to construct this circuit on breadboard, how will you construct? First, choose five different potential lines. Five different potential lines. If you see, this is a different potential line. This is a different potential line, and you can find this up to five. different potential different potential first choose different potentials means see i will construct i will construct the circuit here how i am going to construct look see i am finding see one and two are different potentials i will choose two different potential lines here okay i am i am cons okay 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 this is the one The different potential, and this is the one with the different potential. Okay, look here. An ammeter is connected to this. See, other side of other side of resistor and other side of ammeter. Uh, let us take it's a negative, positive, and it's a negative, positive, and positive, negative, positive, negative. Okay. See, other side of the resistor and negative side of ammeter is connected at same potential so let's connect here so it's let's connect ammeter yeah and i connected different potential some are other different potential no need to connect here you can connect here also it should be a different potential than two okay you connected okay ammeter at some different potential now you find here at at node at a different potential node 3 you are you are seeing three different elements ammeter ammeter and diode 
see here what i will do is i will construct i will connect one diode okay i connected at 3 i am i want three elements at node 3 i want three elements i already connected to one ammeter and ammeter again i need to connect one more ammeter okay i will connect one more ammeter okay it's a different potential it's a different potential for four okay in this same line you need to connect see at potential node 4 at potential node 4 you are able to see three different elements ammeter resistor and voltmeter you need to connect at ammeter okay and you need to connect it at fourth po four position you need to connect three elements one ammeter is completed and you need to connect one resistor and one voltmeter okay how i am connecting see just check this is the node just check this is node 4 this is node 3 node 2 <laughs> node 1 okay what happening node 1 just check at node 1 you have two elements okay i need to connect one battery for negative terminal here okay i connect a negative terminal see sorry you need to connect this terminal here this consisting same line right yeah this line is i connected here okay see just check okay see just check here we'll check we'll cross check whether the circuit which we constructed on bedboard is correct or not mm, check node one we have two elements battery and resistor here also okay same at node 2 we have resistor and ammeter we are going to see resistor and ammeter okay at node 3 you are go you are seeing ammeter and ammeter and sorry at ammeter ammeter and diode and you can check here at node 3 you have three elements right yes at node 4 resistor resistor and ammeter three elements are there at node 4 you can find three elements node 5 one positive side of the battery, negative side of diode and resistor and negative side of voltmeter or in the same line, in the same line potential you can find four components okay, four other sides L sorry yeah, you can find four different potential on fifth side okay fine we have constructed very easily if you want to construct other any circuit see see the circuit now we will construct this circuit on this see now first thing we need to find if you want to construct any circuit if you want to construct any circuit first you need to find different potential nodes in that circuit then take the same number of different potential nodes on breadboard and construct first step step one find different potential nodes in the circuit ok let's find that's fine okay see this see this is circuit okay see that's yeah this is the element and you can find this is the element okay see look at here if you see this is one node this is one node this is a connection you don't see these junctions yeah this is just a wire this is just a wire if you the, this is the point where 
other side of a meter and other side of the battery is connected mark it as one and next if you see this other side of a meter and one side of a resistor is connected here yeah you can node 2 see this is the other node node 3 this is 4 node 4 here and you can see this is node 5 if you see here yeah this is node 6 node 7 node 7 see what happened the voltmeter is connected same point at the same point you can see other side of a meter other side of sorry other side of a resistor on one side of a resistor and one side of voltmeter the connected point same point if you see here one side of the resistor one side of the resistor and one side of the voltmeter and positive side of the battery how many nodes you are finding here seven different potential nodes yeah seven take seven different potential nodes on the circuit and you can construct very easily see we will construct whatever whatever the part you take your wish take consider any point consider any point see now i'm taking uh, considering three and seven hmm? three and seven means i will consider see what i what i am doing you can understand here yeah i'm naming it as three and it has seven okay good yeah i don't want a sister and next uh, same in the same line in the same line you are going to find five holes here yeah huh? the five holes is that means that the same potential you can construct here see you can construct you can construct one more resistor yeah you can name it as four as you found here you can name it as four hmm. see at node three how many are there at node three you can find three elements right first take one node okay we found one node at node 3 how many elements are there one two three first at node 3 complete the number of elements which are there okay at node 3 i'm constructing one more resistor okay at node 3 i construct one more resistor this is a different potential node uh, 2 okay i named as 2 can complete it and go node by node okay at node 2 at node 2 you have other side of a potential other side of a meter right okay construct here other side of a meter which is connected mm, how what's the way it's connected yeah okay you connect what's there you connect a meter here a meter and connect the other side of a meter to a different potential name it is one two three completed fourth take the fourth position right po at uh, node four you have uh, two different elements connected to that node four you connect here at node 4 a meter okay completed and uh, at node 5 we have other side of a meter and one side of the what is that okay it's a node 5 i'm constructing a sister okay completed yeah this side this is this you can name it as 6 from six from seven to six you have one other element you construct from seven to six from seven to six okay completed you see from seven to six you have old meter the same line you construct on old meter completed oh okay. yeah and at node seven at node seven look here at node seven we have one two three four four elements you can see here three elements one other element is a battery the positive side of the battery and this positive side of the battery is connected to node 1 as you can see here the positive side of the battery is connected to node 1 so also negative terminal you can connect to node 1 yeah it's a simple way to construct any circuit in on board and bed board i hope you understood very well thank you